More on coronavirus and its awareness, the Indian American Kerala Center organized a virtual seminar addressing COVID-19 health issues and honored frontline hero medical professionals and first responders. The center proudly promotes Malayalam language and literature while serving the Kerala Indian American community needs and accomplishments. The virtual event saw appreciation of 100 healthcare workers and police officers from Queens and Long Island in New York for their service during the pandemic. The recognition ceremony was followed by a seminar and a panel discussion featuring experts and doctors on prevalent issues related to COVID-19 and the South Asian American community. Here are some highlights from the virtual event presented by the Indian American Kerala Center. It is a great pleasure and I am so proud to host this meeting for honoring our sisters and brothers working in the medical field and us first responders who sacrificed so much in these difficult times. You deserve our appreciation. Kerala Tile Grama Pradesh Nursing Padicha America Kudiri Superpower I Rajatinde Invisible Shatruvin Yola Yutatil Munani Padiali Lai and Namada Sahodri Sahodar and Mar Namade Apimana Mana many perished in this war, many injured and uh, did not re- still they did not retreat. They persisted. They got up every morning and went to serve their fellow human beings suffering from the pandemic. That is an amazing act of bravery, which we need to appreciate. Jeevitha Tinde, Andiman Mishangali Laro Rimila, Tarina worker, Ashwas and Burna, Urikaitanga in the Kaval Mala Kamarana, our Niswarthamai Sevenum, Namade Apinan the new Wangi Garum, Arakikino, Namukavaro de la Snehum, Katapadum, Nani Marik in the Dana, e meeting. We have several dignitaries and community leaders with us to express their appreciation. We have uh, Honorable A.K. Vijay Krishnan Sar with us. He is Consul for Community Affairs at the Indian Consulate in New York. And they have been working the Kerala Central program in Varan, Nidhidhana, Pashay Covid Garna Madhin Sadh Jilla, Covid Kemari, Andarish and Shandamagam Bol, Adehatne Kerala. Kerala Center Lake, Windham Shanikin the Dairikum. Thank you to Kerala Center for honoring our frontline heroes. A special thank you to Alex Estepan and the entire board for inviting me. I am honored to take part in this program today. Let me start off by saying a big, big thank you to all our healthcare workers and essential workers for everything that they did for us and continue to do to keep this pandemic at bay. I'm so very proud of all of you. We owe you so much. All of you are our heroes. We are all going through a very tough time with the spread of COVID. And most of you are very likely to look at the past year and even this year as one of the most difficult times in our lives, personally and professionally. This global pandemic has impacted all of us very hard directly and indirectly. From a governance standpoint, my district in New York was impacted by the death of so many individuals, jobs lost, businesses shut down, and communities devastated. I've seen homelessness rise, food lines grow miles long, but we are going to get through this because we are Americans and because we have dealt with a lot of things and because we are smart, we are resourceful, and we are united. The Indian community and specifically the Kerala community achieved another recognition being the frontline workers and doctors as do- frontline workers as doctors, nurses, and other healthcare professionals. You have also, you already heard from Kevin, uh, our Senator Thomas and uh, Mr. Vijay Krishnan, what the kind of work which they have been doing. And it's <laughs> fit that we Kerala Center call this um, meeting to recognize them. Although we are only recognizing only uh, some of them, while the total number is much, much higher. But it is, uh, we are conveying to all of them that uh, we appreciate their work, we compliment, we thank you, and we pray for you in the kind of work which you are doing. Um, I compliment Kerala Center for, the great in, for this great initiative. 
and i hope those who are not members of kerala center consider becoming a member uh, thank you so much i'm not taking much time uh, the covid 19 pandemic uh, we all know about that our healthcare workers uh, they uh, they were in the front line and fighting for us so this is a great auspicious uh, occasion to salute them um, i am uh, on behalf of forma i take this opportunity to salute them uh, we wish you all the best uh, our prayer support always with them um, uh, uh, may almighty god shower all the blessings their day to day life we salute them again again and again thank you thank you so much ellarkku ende namaskaram good evening friends good evening. of uh, the heroes the frontline heroes families and all you out there celebrants who we want to recognize today first of all i want to thank you alex estefan and the board of directors of the kerala center for putting this program together so such a worthwhile program and for giving me the opportunity to share my thoughts well it's been more than a year it was february 3rd when the us government declared it a public health emergency due to the pandemic and we are we are getting used to living in this pandemic afflicted world but grateful people from all nations i have been coming forward to celebrate the amazing healthcare and essential service workers because they exemplified the highest level of compassionate concern and their civic responsibilities in extremely trying circumstances so i to join the kerala center and the guests and dignitaries of the community gathered here today to acknowledge to applaud and to appreciate all the you healthcare and essential service heroes truly these men and women are my newest role models because they epitomize service over self centeredness and others before self well thank you does not seem enough and calling them heroes sometimes come short that said i still want to invoke the good lord to continue to bless each of the frontline workers richly and may you continue to inspire and touch more lives as you have touched mine